Well, I finally got rid of the big camera setting camera system up here. Replaced it with just this one single little camera here. It's high def. It's actually running and recording right now, but you can't see because there is a separate external connection which runs all the way underneath here. It's all installed and comes to the screen here. I've also got one in the back here. And I've got one face in the, the driver, so all the features of the original camera system are replaced. And now if I bring the screen up, I can actually switch between them on this thing here. So this is the rear-facing camera, it's currently recording. And switch around to the front-facing camera. If I put it into reverse, it'll switch to the backup camera, which is built into the car, which is cool. Put it into reverse, and there's the garage door as seen with the backup camera. Take it back out, goes back to the, the front facing camera. Well, the front facing camera has decided to turn off. The reason for that is that I have a special power controller built into the car that will preserve the battery, it will not allow the cameras to run the battery down. So what it does is it monitors the battery voltage and then it turns off the cameras if the battery voltage drops below a preset level. With me turning all the lights on and everything whilst the uh, engine was off, well, it's, uh, it drops the voltage too low. But I can control everything from up here. I can come up here and press that to turn the record off. It takes a couple seconds to react to that. And there it is. Record is turning off. I can come up here. I can press mode. Like this. Switches it into playback. Switches it into photo playback, which there's no files there. And I go into the menu. And I can go through the menus like this. It all works very well, actually. It's extremely good resolution. I mean, it's high def. Um, it's a true HD 1080p. It's the resolution up there in the top corner, 1920 1080p. And it is true resolution, so it's very, very good quality. So that is the, the new system. So the dog ass camera is gone, replaced with this little thing here. The dog is sitting over there watching out the back nowadays. And um, everything else is kind of flush installed and looks pretty nice. So. Well, I like it, so we'll see how that does.